bust it. Good day, Hope Scopus. I have received several requests to review my protein's activewear line. Your wish is my command. Wait. Your wish is my command? Yeah, that's right. Overall, in style and performance, this brand is very similar to Gymshark or Nike. It's actually super affordable. Cue theme music. I will have a discount code down in the description box for 35% off of your order from this brand, but it's only good for this week. So if you really like any of the things that I'm talking about, make sure to head down there and grab the links. I will also have all of my measurements down there for reference. All of that being said, I am not affiliated with this brand and this isn't a sponsored video at all. They just gave me that link for you guys, but this is going to be, per usual, a totally honest review. For those of you wondering if I've tried the My Protein supplements, no. No, I haven't. I am here for the clothes and the clothes only. <laughs> Obviously. Let's jump right into some leggings. Okay, hello, new favorite pair of leggings. These are the Heartbeat full length leggings. I have them in gray and black. They also come in this teal color. I got everything that I'm about to show you in a size small. When I first put these on, they seemed to run a little bit tight, but as I wore them, they started to stretch out a little bit. They have this super cute mesh detailing on the bottom. But that booty dough, they have this heart-shaped stitching on the bottom. You know those heart booty leggings that have been floating around the internet? These give that same shape without being gimmicky and absolutely awful. They are mid-rise, but I feel like they kind of hit like more of a high-rise legging. They are a polyester elastane blend. They're the perfect combination of a nice thick legging and something that's still very flexible and breathable. They are definitely squat proof. And as far as sweat proofness goes, any pair of gray leggings is going to show sweat, unless it's like a space dye color. These ones actually did pretty good though. I wore them today to the gym and did a hit cardio session and they actually held up pretty well. There definitely was some sweat showing, but it wasn't anything crazy. If you are genuinely concerned about that though, go with the black. I did not get the teal leggings, but I did get a pair of the teal heartbeat shorts. These do run a little bit small. I mean, they're just a small short in general. They're definitely a booty short. They are made from the same material as the leggings, but I feel like they're stretchier than the leggings are. They have these mesh triangle cutouts on each side, the same heart bum stitching on the back, and they are a high rise short. They are a little bit short for my taste to actually wear to the gym, but they're a good pair of shorts. They're squat proof. Moving on to the tops. I'm just gonna start with my absolute favorite. It's probably my favorite thing from this entire haul. It is the seamless long sleeve tee. I am a sucker for seamless long sleeve tops, if you haven't noticed. That's kind of all I wear in most of my videos. It's made from a nylon material, so it's nice and light and stretchy. Nylon is also nice because it really doesn't shrink. Honestly, this top is like athletic quality. And then the other cute thing about it that I just noticed is on the bottom, on the inside, it has a cute little quote. Who else have I seen do something like this? It's on the tip of my tongue. Thank you. The next top that I got is the Loud Marble Vest. You know it's a European company when they call their tops vests. <laughs> I love the material that this is made out of. It's made from a cooling, soft polyester elastane blend, and it has this nice racer back on the back. The next thing I got in the tops category is the Neo Bomber. Although I would never actually work out in this, this thing is rad. As you can probably tell, it's made from kind of like a stiff neoprene, but it's super soft. I just love it because I feel like it's kind of like edgy high fashion, and it has these mesh cutouts on the shoulders, as well as these big pockets on the sides. And it also comes in black. The next thing I got is the Pro Fit hoodie. This thing comes in a whole bunch of different colors. It's semi-fitted and it has a nice high neck, which I really like, and then it has the drawstrings on either side. It does have thumb holes. It's not insanely soft, it's just kind of your basic sweatshirt cotton material, but I really really like the fit of it. 
And then it has the logo on the chest as well as on the sleeves. And I actually really like their logo. It's just nice and simple. Moving on to some sports bras. I got the Neo sports bra. This is that zipper style high support sports bra. This one is in the mint color. It also comes in a purple gray combination and a teal green combination. It's made from a poly elastane material, but it almost feels like neoprene. You know what this reminds me of? Do you remember when the triangle bikinis were all the rage? I am not a huge fan of zip-up bras, but this one is not a bad one. It doesn't suffocate you in 18 layers of bra like the Victoria's Secret one does, but it also doesn't just spontaneously come unzipped like the Walmart one does. So if you're into this style of bra, this is a really nice one. The next thing I got is the Heartbeat sports bra. I'm pretty sure that you can buy just the Heartbeat outfit as a whole. It has a nice v-neck front. It's made from the same material that the leggings are. It runs a little bit small cup-wise. Like the elastic band on the bottom is fine, but I felt like I was getting some side poppy outy action in this. It does have pads. It has this super cute mesh back and it is adjustable. When I was working out in this, I did feel very supported. Overall, it's just a very well-built bra. I'm pretty impressed. The last sports bra that I got is the Loud Marble sports bra. This is probably my favorite out of all of them. It's made from the same material that the marble tank top is and it is just so comfy. It's a light to medium support. It does have built-in pads. And then it has this cute, meshy cross back in the back. There are actually some leggings made out of this material too. So if you just want to go bonkers with the loud marble, you have that option. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that this review was helpful to you. Overall, I really was impressed by this brand. I didn't have that high of expectations, to be honest, but I really like it. Make sure to give this video a like before you go, and we will see you guys in the next video. It's gonna be a good one. Huh, Leo? Say bye, YouTube!